Greetings and salutations, friends, it's Hadrian here. Welcome to another video. Today we are at the Goodwill in on Adams. And we are in the city of Huntington Beach. Let's go inside and check it out. Okay, we are in handbag section first. Oh, we have a Rebecca $17.99. I don't like that the top flap of the zipper is like, or the, the pocket is like a different color. Let's see. It's big, that one's kind of worn, not scary form. This looks like that is a Michael Kors. Do people still like this bag? I remember back in the day, like this bag was such a popular style, the Hamilton. But that one's 20 bucks. Got a denim bag right there. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh, here's another Michael Kors. This one's the Selma. It has like some weird indents in it though. When I was here before you guys, I found that um, there was like that rower machine that was like really expensive. I think it was only 200 or 150, 250, but it was like a $1,200 or $1,500 machine. It was like right here. Oh, this mirror is kind of nice. It's a Target one, but it has some damage. Now I'm looking through the glassware. If there's any cool crystal or anything. Oh, it's almost holiday season too, so it's about time to start collecting these for my aunts. They love anything crystal, like faces, bowls, mugs, anything like that. I'm trying to see if they have any Stanleys or anything this looks like a oh it is a kate spade i was just gonna say that's only eight bucks hot dog all right let's get this i think right just have like a little mark right there but i feel like we can get the mark out oh the kate spade on the back has been like it's like gone but the hardware's still there you know the section that never fails me the mug section. What kind of mugs do you have for me today? I think this is a Starbucks. Oh, it is $3.99. These are cute. They're stackable. I used to have like a bunch of those. Anything else? Any anthro? Oh, how cute. has a little snowman inside. Anything here? <gasps> yeah. Oh my gosh, there's a little kitty cat. World Market. Marilyn. Little puppy one with the Christmas lights. This is a Target one, $1.50. Now we have more glasses. Aren't you have these jumping out at me? good for like soap I could buy the sink or something like that's a cute little thing to hold it plates the big one sango oh, the little pie that's cute the Hanukkah plates, nice. Oh, these are from Sterlatop. $10 each, $2 here. Oh, there's a bunch of them too. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 10, 12. This looks like a marble thing. Oh, it's heavy. This is from Target probably. And I think it is 15 bucks though. Oh, I have one of those already. It's on the kids' table in the kitchen. I don't kind of like this. Oh, Threshold Studio making a wonder. This is nice. How cute. It's like a little thing for um, garlic or something. But there's a little mushroom on the top, I think. Yeah, it is a little mushroom. Four bucks. BW Princeton West. Artwork. Oh, 
Look at that little gnome. <gasps> the little rabbit. Oh, the little pig. So cute. I love looking through the little knickknacks. There's a Buddha, bears. Oh, how cute, post office. I just found like this, this is like for kids crafts, but this is good packaging paper. I wonder how much this is. Tempted to buy these Sharpie clear views. Not that I have anything to highlight just cause they look so cool. I wonder if my dad still uses highlighters. Oh, I have one of these little French sofas for my Laboo-Boos. It's so cute, they look so adorable on there. Cups. I don't think so. Hey guys, okay, so we are at the house and I'm really excited to show you guys what we ended up getting today. We went to the thrift store. So we went to Goodwill. Um tell me why we had like a thing of these at the store. I literally bought almost all of them because they were all a dollar fifty. There were a couple of them that were like two ninety nine, so I didn't get them. But these brushes are like twenty five dollars at Sephora. Or ulti, it was, they had, they're like 25 bucks, like retail, so $1.50. And they're a really cute color, they say main, and then it's like in this like, pretty colorway. Um, so I bought all of them, I'm gonna give my mom one and my sister one, and then, um, maybe you guys will want one, I don't know. But so cool, I bought a bunch, I bought one, two, three, four, Oh, there's my seat. Five. Six. I bought six of them. So, brushes for everyone. I got those. Ooh, the other crazy thing that I got. Okay, so this was also nuts because I found this Theragun Mini. Um, I'm going to see if I can get it to work. It doesn't have a charge in it. So, I am not... 100% certain, but who knows, it could work, um, so we'll see, we will see, this was $9.99, I hope it works, so this thing retails for a lot, right, I forget how much their gun minis cost, but I think it's like over a hundred, for sure, -sy. uh, let's see, their gun mini, and retail, oh, $1.99, so, We'll see if this works, right? One ninety nine. It. I just need a charger, and then I need like um one of the attachments. But we'll start with the charger first and see if it works. And then I actually might even have like a charger for this, so we will see. But cool, cool. Cross your fingers for me. Hopefully we can get that working because that would be awesome. Um. Oh, and then I got this. It's a uh. I think this is the Haunted Mansion. It's from, it's like a Disney, like, journal notebook thing. It's brand new. It would retail at the store for 30 bucks. So, this was cool. I think I got, I forgot how much they gave this to me for. Because someone ripped off the price, and then I didn't know how much it was. I asked them at the front. But, I honestly don't remember. I think it was, like, $10? I don't know. But I just thought this was really, really cool. It comes with a pen and everything. And I just thought it was really, really cute. So, got that. Then I picked up... Oh, I got this. So, this is the um, that Kate Spade tote bag, right? Um, black. It's like a Safiano style. Um, I don't know if this is leather. It might be like a coated canvas. But it has a little hardware piece that's intact right there. Um, Kate Spade in gold has rubbed off on the back but it's on the back and on the bottom so you're not even gonna notice um i feel like it just needs a little tlc like a little cleaning a little conditioning the inside isn't too bad it's missing the, an interior pouch there's one that there's a little attachment right there but this was only eight dollars so i thought this was a good deal it's a good like everyday like tote bag if you just need something to carry like books or your laptop or something i feel like this is great and kate spade then I found this guy. Now this is, um, oh no, just kidding. I, I picked this back up from Adrian, from Adrian. Never mind. I don't even know if I showed this though, but this is a, this is a coach 
domed satchel that I got. Um, this was $12.99. Uh, but it's in black, silver hardware. It has this, like, light green interior lining. It does have some staining inside of there. But it's really cute regardless. Um, and it'll clean up really nicely. It just has some wear right there on the hardware. But this one is the coolest piece that I found. Now, this is a Coach, like, uh, messenger, kind of like briefcase style bag. And it's in, like, this thick black leather. This is from Coach, um... It has like the coach leatherware tag inside right there it has the coach leatherware um like creed and handcrafted in china of genuine um cowhide leather it's a 5747 piece so really really cool um i saw one of these bags on ebay for over 250 dollars and I can see why, because this leather is really, really, really nice. And the bag is really well made. There's two open pockets. There's a zipper pocket behind it with a, another pocket to the inside. And it has like three pen slots. There's a zipper and then two pockets right there. And then it has um, the little belty pieces that you can attach down there. Cross body strap is adjustable. And it does have um, a little side pocket right here oh it has two side pockets so it's two side pockets and it has like some white marks but those are easy to get off like probably like a little um nail polish remover or like um cleaner will get that off and it just needs a good conditioning and then it'll be good to go but it's a really cool bag and that is actually going to round out today's video thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today as you can see i have a ton of stuff around me um we're gonna have a live sale uh, the day after this video goes out so when you see this it's probably on a Monday so the live sale would have happened already but join us for the live sales I have them throughout the week and I also I have a uh, standing live every Saturday at 10 p.m. Pacific time so join me on one of those um, but yeah uh, don't forget to check out tomorrow's new video 7 a.m. I have a new video every day Monday through Friday at 7 a.m. and hope to see you guys there give the video a thumbs up and I'll see y'all later all right bye guys